Wow, guys, it's great to see you again. I'm so glad you came back. We're going to have another awesome toy opening today. Take a look at this one. This is Star Wars from the new Force Awakens movie. This is Poe's X-Wing Fighter. Wow, this is a big toy, and it's really cool. And guys, if you enjoy this video, make sure you click like. And also, we're going to have today's secret word at the end of the video. And if you wait till the end of the video, there's an awesome end card with a lot more fun videos with. Okay, let's see what was in the box. This thing looks awesome. Okay, first, you've got the Poe 3.75 inch figure with the helmet and the little pistol. He looks really detailed. He's got the cool rebel symbol on his vest. And then here, is the X-Wing fighter before I take anything out. As you can see, see BB-8 is included with this one. So that is really cool. Awesome. Let's put this guy together. Wow, guys. This Pose X-Wing fighter really is awesome. I mean, this is a really cool collector's toy. I mean, I reviewed. I think this is the fourth Pose X-Wing fighter I reviewed. So I reviewed pretty much all the ones that came out for Star Wars Force Awakens. And this one, if you ask me, besides the Lego one, this one is the best. Because they built this one really good quality. I mean, it is plastic, but it's not... It feels really nice and heavy and solid. It's not one of the uh, really cheap ones. Some of these Pose X-Wing fighters are really cheap. Okay, uh, before we take a look at the X-Wing fighter and his feature, let's go ahead and take a look at Poe himself because he looks really cool. He has a, a helmet that is removable, so you can see his face underneath there. The rebel symbol, he's got the vest, the communication system. Uh, he's got his standard pilot colors. He's got a little holster here, which his pistol fits into like perfectly which is a really nice feature and there is the back of him so i mean they did a really good job with the quality of this uh 3.75 inch figure and he fits right into the cockpit pit of the x-wing fighter so we could go ahead and open that up slide him in there Okay, so, I mean, like I said, he does fit in there really nicely, and the cockpit cover closes over him really nice and firm, and then it locks into place. So if you're being uh, a little rough with this, flying it around, he's not going to fall out. Okay, let's go ahead and take a look at this, this uh, vehicle all around, then I will show you its features. So, I mean, I really like the coloring they did with the dark gray and the orange. That is really nice. And it's cool that they included BB-8 there. I mean, he's part of the feature of the wings. When you push him down, that's what spreads out the X-Wings on the fighter. So, that is really cool. The engine detail on this is really nice. I mean, they went all out. Some of these are a little bent from when you got them uh, in the box. But you could bend them back. And then we'll take a look at the back of this figure. Actually, the back of this plane. So, I mean, like I said, they did a great job with the detail on the engine. So there you have, like, the uh, the four, uh, like, exhausts here from the engine there. And then you have the main engine part back here which I mean I really like that detail they put on there and then uh the other side is pretty similar to the first side and then uh let me show you some of the features one of the features I really like on this one it has a switch here behind BB-8 if you push it back the wings close together so then you have more of a uh, like a fighter pilot, like a fighter plane look. And then if you push down BB-8, that's when the wings separate and they lock into place. I mean, they lo they're locked securely. I mean, you could close these wings and they will pop right open. So I really like the fact that they locked them in there really nice. That 
is an awesome feature. Now, like I said, if you turn the switch, it'll turn back into uh, more of a fighter pilot look. And then BB-8 looks really cool. Uh, his head turns around and everything. I mean, his body does not move. Because that's what they use for the to lock the wings open, that the play feature. So that is nice. And then let's check out the uh, bottom of it also. Because the bottom of it, you have a firing missile here. Which, if you push this button here, it fires the missile at a really good velocity. I mean, this thing will go, you know, quite a distance. So you don't really want to shoot it at anybody. Because you could hurt somebody if you hit them in the eye. Because, I mean, out of the Star Wars toys I reviewed, I've done a lot of them. This one shoots the missile the farthest. So that is really cool, too. Then here you have a little stand here for when the plane lands and if you want to pose him. But the problem with the stand is when you're firing the missile, you have to close this. Because the missile will hit this and it will just get deflected. Like, let me show you there. See, the missile just hits that, and then it's not as fun. So, this, like I said, this is a really cool uh, plane. And if you were looking to buy one of the X-Wing fighters besides the Lego one, I would definitely consider this one. The quality, the weight, I mean, balance and everything of it is really nice. And like I said, I mean, if you're uh, doing like play acting with this or just having fun with it, I mean, you could shake this everywhere. I mean, nothing falls out. The cockpit does not open up. BB-8 does not fall out. I mean, no pieces fall off. So this is a really nice, solid plane. Wow, guys, that was so much fun. That is such a cool toy, the Pose X-Wing Fighter. And guys, today's secret word is the number four, spelled F-O-U-R. Go ahead and put that in the comment section down there, down below the video. And I'll know that you enjoy this video and that you're a member of my club. And if you wait till the video ends, there's an awesome end card with a lot more fun videos. Jurassic World and Indians and Peppa Pig and Star Wars. And wow, we'll have so much fun together. And guys, did you remember, remember to vote? Make sure you... Click that little white button in the top right hand corner and vote. Well guys, I hope to see you soon.